everyone, it's Neil here from 3D Tutor, and today I'm going to show you how to create a lead window, uh, the fastest and most efficient way that I've found. So let's get started. So let's create a plane. So Shift A, plane, R, Y, 90, R, Z, 90, just to get it to the front. And let's just bring it up. And we'll make it a little bit smaller on the X axis. Press the tab button. We're already in face mode, but we'll hit faces. E. S, bring it in. Make sure these are the same distance apart so it looks realistic. S, Z, bring it up. Grab this back plane. Delete. Faces. Grab the old thing with L. Extrude. E. Grab this face. Extrude back. Now we can delete the back of it. Go to front mode. Shift A. Bring in a cube make it smaller bring it out a bit delete the back face and we can also delete the top and bottom face grab these edges control B bring them in L to grab the whole thing and now let's bring it up. So S said, keep going. Doesn't matter how long you do it. Press the P button, selection, click on this, R, Y, 45. Bring it up to where you want it. Press Z, go into wireframe. Come over here to this little spanner, click on modifiers, array. Put this to zero. Move this one down to whereabouts you, the distance you want from them. And click this button. And then Shift D, R, Y, 90. And then we've got our lead parts all done. Click Apply, click on this one, click Apply. Join them both together, so Control J. Hit the tab to go into edit mode. Click A. Come up here to mesh, click on the bisect button, and now level up with the uh, top of, middle of the top frame, come across, and then down here we can just pull this open, clear, outer, and we don't need to fill because they're inside the, uh, the window. A again, come up here, mesh, bisect, down again, and this time we clear the inner. Okay, clear the outer and the final one now, just clear this one. Okay, press the Z button, go back in solid and then just move them back to the window. And that's the easiest, fastest way I've found to do this. Okay guys, if you found this useful, like and subscribe, and if you like what I do, just look down below the, this video and you'll see a link to my online courses. Thanks a lot, bye bye.